the LG V20 is here and today I'm in the video about Metro by T Mobile. So this is on prepaid fake news dot com here and this article got um, got published a few days ago so this article got published on September eighth. So I'm sure some of you guys might have heard about this already. But I'll give you guys my opinions on it here. So it says that T Mobile reportedly asking Metro by T Mobile customers to switch to postpaid. Now this is very interesting. And so basically what I guess basically basically it's saying that T Mobile is asking Metro customers to switch to postpaid. Some people some people might do it, some people might not do it, you know. So uh, this is very interesting, so that's what that's the Say about it here. So it says, hey, Team Mobile sent out a confusing message to its dealers. This message was posted as a screenshot by a Twitter user. And here is what the message reads. So starting September 10th, which is uh, today is September 12th. So it's um so this is already uh, taking place as it was video recording. Uh, so like my Team Mobile customers. We will receive an SMS with the following message. Congrats on 12 months of timely payments. You are you can now qualify for zero down financing and more incredible benefits when you switch to T-Mobile. That's what it says. And then it goes on to say, customers are receiving this offer as a thank you for being a loyal customer who pays the bill on time monthly. That means they're eligible to join T-Mobile SP qualified postpaid customers and can enjoy awesome on carrier benefits like our Apple Primus, Zero Dawn, on Select handsets, and T Mobile Tuesdays. With our Magenta family plans, they also get Netflix on us, taxes and food included, and more. So that's what the uh, message said there. What makes this message confusing is the part. It says when you switch to T-Mobile, since T-Mobile owns Metro by T-Mobile, this caused some confusion. Are they abandoning their prepaid brand? We don't know. Or are they encouraging more people to switch to postpaid instead of prepaid? Keep going to, I don't know if T-Mobile's going to phase out Metro by T-Mobile, who knows? Um, you know, T-Mobile prepaid is dead. Um, I don't know who uses T-Mobile prepaid now, but Metro by T-Mobile is now T-Mobile's main prepaid brand now, so uh, Metro is doing good. T-Mobile prepaid is pretty much dead now. Uh, the screenshot was even posted as a response to a tweet sent out by Metro dealers last week on an update on the 10 one tangers. T-Mobile promised the dealers group that they will be discussing additional updates on September 10th, which is what's also coincides the date on the screenshot. So there's the uh, screenshot there. If I can, if I can click on it so we can get it bigger here, so you get out, so you can also see yourselves. Let's take it. I want to go here. I click on this up here. Same name. So this is what the message here says here. Um, it's basically you know they're basically asking Metro customers to switch to postpaid very pretty much what they're asking here. So let's take action to direct customers to the landing page. The text message for more details. Customers can redeem this offer by going to a team of retail location, calling the number or clicking on the chat on the learning page. So, uh, yeah, this is very interesting, guys. I mean, is is team of trying to get rid of Metro? Who knows if team of trying to get rid of Metro prepaid brand? Who knows? Um, but it says switch to team of and get, um, and, and you'll be pre-qualified. Obviously, if you guys go to postpaid, you guys will need great credit. They go to postpaid, of course, so they do check your credit. Um, they do check your credit. They ask for your social security number and stuff like that. If you guys sign up for a postpaid brand service, you do, you do need great credit for that to work. Um, if you guys have bad credit, you guys cannot get postpaid service. 
because you will get the uh, post paid service if you guys have bad credit. But if you guys have good credit and you guys want to check us out, go right ahead. But if you guys have bad credit and do not, do not, don't do this because you will get denied. So um, this is good for people who have great credit, of course. Because they will check your credit, they'll, uh, they'll ask for your social security number, birth date, and stuff like that. So, I mean, this is very interesting, yeah. So, what, what, so what, uh, so what do you guys think about T Mobile asking Metro customers to put this was supposed to be? And, and, um, and I want to know, do, do, do you guys think that T Mobile is trying to get rid of Metro by T Mobile all together? Or do you think that, or do you guys think that Tamil, or you think that Tamil was trying to encourage more people to switch to postpaid into the prepaid? What are what are y'all opinions about this? Um, this is very interesting. Um, so I don't know, cause you know a lot of people go to Metro because it's prepaid, of course. They don't check your credit, and their credit checks, of course, and their contracts. Um, and oh yeah, when you guys need it all. Pretty sure you guys want to sign a contract as well, even though it's not a two year contract per se, you still have to sign a contract. Like I said, you need good credit for post paid service, social security number, photo ID, and stuff like that. Uh, if you guys have bad credit, don't even do anything while uh, fucking with this deal because they'll check your credit and they see if they, and if they see that your credit is bad, you will get denied. So yeah, if you guys have great credit and you guys want to check this out, go right ahead and check it out for yourselves if you, have, if you guys have great credit. I mean, yeah. In order to get post paid service, you, if, in order to get post paid service, you guys must have great credit to get post paid service. It's pretty much self explanatory. Um, if you guys have bad credit, get prepaid, of course, or whatever. It's, it's up to you. If you guys have uh, bad, uh, bad credit, get prepaid. If you guys have great credit, you can choose some postpaid or prepaid choices yours. But the choice is harder when you guys have bad credit and you're more and you're more limited of of what you can do. Uh, if you guys have bad credit, if you guys have great credit, you guys need to. Um, if you guys have great credit, uh, you can do a lot of stuff. You know, you know, you can do a lot of stuff. So, so, uh, uh, so just be careful with that stuff. You know, just be careful with it. I'll make sure that it don't get out of control or stuff like that, you know. So, uh, yeah, I mean, I guess you're, I guess you are, I guess you're pretty qualified for Team Mobile. I'm guessing they'll, I'm sure they'll ask you for your social security number and fair ID and stuff like that and shit like that, so they'll ask you for that. So, Team Mobile would check, Team Mobile will check your credit, they will check it. Uh, so do keep in mind, of course, you know, Verizon does, AT&T does it, you know, they check your credit if you guys are trying to get postpaid service. Um, if you guys have great credit, get postpaid or prepaid, choice of service. Um, if you guys have, uh, bad credit, you, uh, don't even, don't even try to get this deal, don't, don't, don't try to get it because you will get denied if you guys have bad credit. Uh, so, uh, yeah, this is very interesting and, um, yeah, we don't know what's gonna happen. We don't know what's gonna happen in Metro if, if anything happens, or if people, if or Timo is or or Timo is is trying to get people to switch to postpaid than prepaid. So we'll see about that. And I'm sure some people will actually do this. I'm sorry, for sure some people will probably not do this. So you'll have people that will do it, and you and you are gonna have people that are gonna do it, and you're gonna have people that are not gonna do it. So, uh, yeah. So, uh, this is pretty interesting. So, this is just basically a report. So, uh, there's a message right there if you guys want to check it out. You click on the uh, picture and, and you can read it for yourself. So, uh, yeah. So, that's pretty much it for this video. So, if you guys enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up. Give me a smile a lot. Peace, vote, comment, subscribe. Thank you very much for watching my video. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.